Hai, Assalamualaikum. Sains Form 1, New Chapter, Chapter 6, Periodic Table. Before we start, let's take a look at this table for a while. So, this is the periodic table. Subtopic 6.1, Classification of Elements. Okay, before this, you have learned in Chapter 5 that all things that have mass and occupy space are matter. So, matter consists of small and discrete particles which are known as atoms. For example, here. Here are the arrangement of atoms in a gold ring. All matter consists of atoms which are the most basic unit. An atom cannot be seen with our eyes because its size is too small and discrete. An atom can only be seen using an electron microscope by enlarging the atom to a million times. So, this is electron microscope. Just look at the size. Atom and molecule. Okay, let's complete the circle map. Atom. Atom is the basic unit of matter. Next. Atom can be observed with electron microscope. An atom, atom is a small and discrete size. So, for the conclusion, atom is the simplest particle. Okay, so this is a structure of atom. All matter is composed of atoms. So, as you can see, an atom consists of three sub, sub, sub atomic particles, namely electron, protons, and neutrons. So, scientists locate protons and neutrons in the nucleus. while electrons move around the nucleus in path called orbit. Okay, next. Protons have positive charge Electrons have negative charge and neutrons are neutral as they do not have charge. Okay, next, let's label the structure of an atom. Electron. Electrons move around the nucleus in path called orbit. Next, nucleus. In the nucleus, there are proton and neutron. Next, let's complete the statements. What is proton number? What is nucleon number? Actually, this proton and nucleon number, not in your syllabus, science form 1, actually it is in chemistry form 4, but just for general knowledge, okay? Proton number. Proton number, number of protons, found in the nucleus of every atom of that element. 
For example, the number of proton is 3. So, proton number is the number of protons in an atom. Next, nuclear number is the total, the sum of the number of neutrons and protons in an atomic nucleus. Proton plus neutron in the nucleus. So, nuclear number is the total number of protons plus neutrons in an atom. So, there is nucleon number. Molecules. Molecules are neutral particles made up of two or more atoms. For example, oxygen atom, oxygen molecule now right here hydrogen hydrogen atom hydrogen molecule so a molecule is a group of two or more atoms that are combined combined chemically so for example a hydrogen atom is made up, oh, I'm sorry, a hydrogen molecule is made up of two hydrogen atoms. Next, nitrogen molecule is made up of two nitrogen atom. Next, a carbon dioxide molecule is made up of one carbon atom and two oxygen atoms. Water molecule is made up of one oxygen atom and two hydrogen atoms. So these molecules with same type of atoms while these are the molecules with different type of atoms okay mark the correct statements cross for the incorrect ones okay let's read an atom has different numbers of electrons and neutrons okay actually an atom has the same amount the same amount same amount uh, the, the same numbers of electron and neutron so again uh, it is not in your textbook so the same amount and correct next the nucleus contains protons and neutrons correct next Electrons move around the nucleus. Correct. Next. Two of the same atoms combine. Combination of atoms to form a molecule. Correct. What is an element? During the 18th and 19th centuries, scientists discovered a lot of elements they produced the periodic table which has been arranged in an arranged in an orderly and in a systematic manner and is still being used for today so these are the elements yellow for metal orange for semi-metal and blue for non-metal. Okay. 
elements and compounds. Example of elements, gold rings, pure gold, iron nails, pure iron. Next, example of compound, salt. Okay, salt. 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 N A C L. So, in salt, so salt is a combination of N A sodium and C L chlorine. Next, water. Water is H two O. So, water, H2O. H2O, combination of hydrogen and oxygen. So, these are the examples of compound. While elements, gold ring, that's it, just aurum. Iron nails, just ferrum. Okay, what is an element? An element... Sorry, an element is the simplest, is the simplest form of substance. It cannot be divided, cannot, cannot be divided to two or more simpler substance. There is only one type of atom in an element. For example, hydrogen gas in hydrogen tank. Ferrum, see all F E F E F E, carbon, carbon pencil, all carbon. See inside. Next, what is a compound? A compound consists. Just now it's element, right? So now a compound consists of two uh, or more elements combined chemically. Okay, for example, carbon from coal combines chemically with oxygen in the air when it burns. So, the components of a compound can only be separated chemically, for example, by electrolysis. And they, they the carbon and the oxygen combine, and now it's become carbon dioxide. So, carbon dioxide is a compound. Okay. The same goes to this, salt. Salt, sodium chloride. So, salt is the combination of sodium and chlorine. Next, shell. Shell is calcium carbonate. So, shell is the combination of Calcium, carbon, and oxygen. And the last one is sugar. Sugar is C3H, oh, I'm sorry, C6H12O6. You don't need to remember all this. Okay, so sugar. Combination of carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. So all this, we call it as compound combination two or more elements okay the last one mixtures a mixture consists of two or more compounds mixed physically okay examples of mixture soft drink bronze brass pewter steel seawater air milk orange juice Mm, okay, let's take one example. Air. Air consists not only oxygen, hydrogen, nitrogen, and water vapor, dust, etc. So this is mixture. Um, okay, seawater. Seawater. Got H2O inside, water, um, salt, uh, minerals such as um, sodium, magnesium, etc. So, mixture consists of two or more elements or compounds.
Okay. Uh, identify the diagram below by writing the words given in the space provided. Okay. Let's take a look at this. Mm, compound element mixture. Okay. So the first one, second one, and the third one. So the first one, of course, element. The second one, compound. And the last one is mixture. Okay. Match the diagram below to the correct meaning to show the difference in matter. So the first one is element. Next, compound, compound, combination, two or more elements. And the last one is mixture, combination of elements or combination of mix uh, of compounds or combination of elements and compounds. Then, a substance that consists of a combination of two or more atoms chemi chemically bond together. A substance that consists of a combination of two or more atoms physically, physically mixed together. Okay, so this is definitely this, the answer. A substance that consists of only one. Okay, one, one type. So if one type, it's element. And this is, I'm sorry. So the last one is compound. Okay. Okay. That's all for today. Thank you.